from LA Late Headquarters in Santa Monica, this is Afternoons LA Late. It's a big afternoon as America goes into a big week, the first week after Thanksgiving, and the markets are ready for a big rocky ride. Well, the latest details on what the market is digesting going into a new week, what you should be digesting as well. Brand new massive Santa Claus stimulus checks. We're going to go over these massive sums of money. $300,000, 300 different checks from the federal government. They're huge. They're FSCs. And we have brand new success stories today from other viewers. I'm going to show you how to beat tomorrow's success story on Ally Light. Then we turn to inflation release stimulus checks and then lifetime stimulus checks. Big sums of money all heating up today's broadcast. Plus, Holidays LA has been back on the channel for a few weeks, but today starts up the Santa edition of Holidays LA. As you see, the LA Lake Christmas tree going into the works for the brand new 2022 season. We go back to the Christmas tree part, and we look at the incredible details of how to buy the right tree and the wrong tree in today's recording. Next up, we'll be looking at the brand new details of the Wall Street analysts and economic analysts will be looking in next week. It is the Personal Consumption Expenditure Index, the latest details from the Federal Reserve, and the latest numbers on labor and also debt. Plus, we'll be looking at what happened with those holiday sales. Do they deliver to consumers or do they not? We'll give you the empirical data and also the practical data. As one viewer went to the malls, Monica Blanco, and I'll tell you what she saw and also what's happening. Plus, we'll be looking back at the big success stories that viewers of this channel are getting the stimulus, where that stimulus could take us this week. Wow. A year ago, this channel made history when it got millions of Americans a $600 stimulus check. Now, this year, they're getting $60,000 stimulus checks. It's big money. It's happening right now, and I'll show you how to get it. It's a huge recording from the shores of Santa Monica, California. It's holidays, L.A., in full form. We're going back to the Christmas tree park in today's recording. There's a lot of money and a lot of trees in today's recording. We're going to go over all that and more as a big, bold, beautiful afternoon to LA heats up for Christmas 2022. Good afternoon, everybody. I hope you're having a beautiful day. This is the Christmas tree park, but this is the spirit of the season. I'm going to go into that Christmas tree park today in the big second half. Lots of trees heating up this broadcast and mass stimulus as well. Your economy, your recession, your inflation, your benefit raise, your housing market, and your unemployment, all that breaking news, plus the latest on your four stimulus heats up today's show of Afternoons LA Holiday Edition. How are you? Thank you for joining me on a big show today. Millions of Americans are sitting on more checks from this channel, and those millions of Americans may include you if you just found this channel. What's going on? Congress, back in the month of March, passed a series of checks by congressional action, and the president in his, it did more checks as well. And I call these federal stimulus checks. Back in February of this year, I was the first American recorder, broadcaster, and financial news to record that the U.S. economy would suffer recession. And then, soon right after that, viewers of this channel in March of this year said, if you're right and we're going to recession, can you find me some stimulus? And I did. The first checks, A, B, and C. Since then, I found you more checks, and I'm going to go over all those incredible checks right now. The great news is that all these big Santa stimulus checks are still paying out. And I'm going to show you how to get them in this recording, 
It's a learn to earn show. Stay over this one hour broadcast because we have nearly 300 different checks to go over. And it's all incredible, great stories. And congratulations to Margaret Owens from Kentucky, who sent me a beautiful message just today. This is actually in the last 15 minutes. She said, I think totally, uh, total, she said, I think she's, uh, she said, I think I have gotten nearly $2,600 from your channel in recent weeks. Incredible, great news. Now, one of the great success stories of recent days has been Spelly. Why? He truly embodies what you do on this channel. He watches all the videos and he learns to earn. He had initially gotten check A. I'm going to show you how to get that in a second. It's 12000 Then he got in check C, which can be upwards of forty, eighty thousand dollars $80,000. Then he listened to one recording and he heard about a brand new stimulus N, like Nancy. He got that as well. And guess what he did right after that? This is all, some of these are just in the last few weeks, last few days. He got stimulus N, and then he went back and got more check C. Wow. Will I have more money for Spelly to get in this recording? I will, and also for you. So stay over this one-hour broadcast. But let's first go into the breaking details we're dealing with a brand new week. The number one story this coming new week will what will be those holiday sales numbers. Will the stores post good numbers? And what will they look like? Monica Blanco was our person on the ground. as She was in the stores in Boca Raton, Florida this weekend. And she said the mall is huge and was packed. Not many people in the shoe store or the jewelry store, but Abercrombie and Pitt Finch, packed. Bad Bath and Body Works, packed. Oh, wow. And she said, there was moderate traffic in Forever 21, but the cell phone Apple store packed across the board. This is really what we're looking at in these latest numbers that are coming in. So far, the only numbers we have yet from Wall Street on these holiday numbers was that online shoppers spent a record of $5.29 billion on Thanksgiving, an increase of 2.9 year over year. And I think the... Um, I think the whole weekend long, the total number for the whole weekend was $9 billion, which is about a 3% increase compared to the prior year. Good. Now, the reason why the online sales are better than the in-store sales is because the online has not been hit that much by inflation. But ultimately, what we're looking to see is whether those sales numbers showed up in also the business bottom lines. Now, one of the things we're not going to see this new week is how much of those sales were driven by credit card debt or driven by actual cash on hand. Credit card debt is not sustainable. So if the consumer spent money this weekend with a credit card, they may be maxing out that credit card by the end of December and will have nothing left for early next year if they do not have the cash to pay off that credit card debt. Fascinating across the board. Going into the weekend, we also had another fascinating number, and that was the labor number. The labor number, which was released on Wednesday, because Thursday was a Thanksgiving holiday, was not a good number. How bad was the number? It was 249,000. Ouch. Let's go over how that number has grown, dropped, and then grown again. It was 140, then went to 260 from August to late September, then fell back, fell back down to 140. Well, the latest number is now at a 249 plus, up from 225 last week. Not good across the board. The Federal Reserve address situations like this in their latest comments from the last meeting. Those FOMC minutes were released on Wednesday after the markets closed. Friday was a half day of the markets trading. So they have not had a full day of trading based upon these Fed minutes and that first day will come on Monday. And what do the Fed minutes say, and what do they not say, that impacts you and your wallet? Federal Reserve did say that they're going to soften up the interest rate spikes on a monthly basis, meaning they're not going to do 75 basis point, they're likely to do 50 basis point. And that's a little bit austere, then eventually they'll go to 25. That's not surprising. We had already reported that on this channel over the last few weeks. What the Federal Reserve did not say but that Wall Street are, analysts are wrongly going to tell you on Monday is that the minutes did not say the Federal Reserve is going to stop interest rate spikes. The minutes did not say there's going to be a Fed pivot. And yet fully expect Wall Street analysts on Monday to say those minutes suggest there'll be a Fed pivot. They do not suggest that. 
So the Federal Reserve is repeating their messaging very clear with Esther George and uh, and Boulard from St. Louis is speaking on Monday, actually. He's going to repeat as well, which is we need to get inflation down to 2% and stay there for several months. We're far, far away from it. We've seen inflation improve a little bit, they may say, but it hasn't come down to 2%. It's still at 7.5 plus. So we have all this year, all of 2023 and all of 2024. And that is why we lead with the data on today's channel, because there is a lot of data coming this brand new week. We've already seen unemployment in this recording. We've already seen the Federal Reserve. We've already seen interest rates. Now, what does this mean for interest rates in you? It means that all that incredible debt that Americans are consuming right now will be more costly by January 1 than it is right now, because the Federal Reserve is going to raise those interest rates in December and January and continuing all next year. And that, my friends, is why you have to get a stimulus check. The big stimulus checks available for the viewers of this channel right now are huge. Santa stimulus checks, $300,000, 300 different checks from the federal government. The federal government sends it out. They administer it. They pay it. has nothing to do with your states. And I'm going to go over all these incredible checks in just a second. The icing on the cake is then the incredible money at issue with those big, bold, beautiful inflationary stimulus checks. Incredible, incredible inflation checks. Those incredible inflation checks are huge because guess what? They are just beautiful icing on the cake. Thereafter comes those big now lifetime stimulus because once your pamphlets go up, they never go down. Incredible great news. We're going to go over all those incredible details in just a second. But first, what's important to understand is that this brand new week will have not only the reaction to those Federal Reserve minutes, not only the reaction to those latest numbers for labor, but also we'll have the reaction to the latest numbers from housing. The data from housing, folks, is not good, and it's going to get worse. On top of that, so will auto. Housing starts down, existing home sales down, build of confidence down. And next to be really hit by these inflationary elements is the auto industry. Car sales are going to be down this holiday season, used and new, and people who have existing cars with car loans may not be able to afford it. So the, how, the car industry is really going to collapse very quickly in my prediction. Carvana already laid off 10% of its workforce in one day. The company may run out of cash, says one analyst in a new report last week. We also had AutoZone and, and another auto company yesterday, uh, the other day report dissipating numbers, disappointing numbers. So very, very indicative of where we're going. Housing falling apart, auto falling apart because of inflation, and the next industry, maybe some apparel, and we don't know where. That's why Monica Blanco's reporting was so important. She said that Bath and Body Works was crowded, so people were buying scrubberies and shampoo and soap, and she also says apparel was crowded, Abercrombie & Fitch, which we also had in the data this week. But she says jewelry was not crowded. So if jewelry is not crowded, what does that tell us about this economy? Very confusing? Yes. And I'll have more about this later in this recording. And this is why you want to get all these incredible stimulus checks. Massive amounts of money. Let's start with the first category of checks. They are federal stimulus checks, and they are absolutely incredible. Have you become a member? These are the checks the viewers are cleaning up on. Let's look at those incredible federal stimulus checks starting right now. Where do they come from? The first three checks came from Joseph Biden <laughs> by check A, B, and C, passed by the President of the United States by executive action in the month of March. They are absolutely incredible. $100,000, you qualify. Single individual, $75,000 less, go get it. Marry a couple, $150,000 less, go get it. And if you're on SSI, SSDI, Social Security, Railroad Benefits, Veterans Benefits, go get it. It is for you. These were passed in March. Then Congress came along and passed more checks, E through K, bringing us to lots of hundreds of checks for you, the Purple Power membership. Go into this video, become a member, and pounce and get all those incredible checks. Where are they? In the Yellow Light newsletter. You go down under the video after you join this, uh, after you watch this video, join the channel, and then you get that newsletter. And in the newsletter is where you click and apply for these incredible checks. Bring us to hundreds of incredible checks of these big, bold, beautiful uh, FSC checks. They're just absolutely, absolutely incredible. 
These incredible FSC checks are huge. And again, how do you get it? You become a member. Go around this video, become a member. Purple Hawk, Purple Power, Calcino VIP. Let me give you a benchmark of what's happening with these Santa stimulus checks right now. So the latest trend line for the viewership of, of this channel, the members are this channel are the following. Viewers who are single or married, with children or without children, and viewers who are watching this channel who are on SSI, SSDI, Social Security and Wearable Benefits, and Veterans Benefits, are getting checks. And they're getting lots of them. How many months? They're getting 18 months of checks. How much are the checks on average per month? They are getting on average about five checks a month. Five checks a month of about $2,000 a month total over 18 months, that is at least $36,000. Now, some viewers are getting more than that. Now, they're also getting other of these checks, because that's just one category of checks, others of these checks, bringing them to like forty dollars or $50,000. Now, a lot of viewers are getting close to 100000 or 150000 It's very straightforward. Moreover, the success story, the success rate of viewership is faster than ever before. It used to be that a viewer would become a member and then they would have a success story, you know, maybe two months out. No, we have viewers who are joining this channel in less than 30 days. They are sitting on 18 months of checks and lots of money per month. Len Glenn is a true embodiment of the Purple Power Spirit. And I want you to listen carefully to this if you are on SSI, SSDI, Social Security, Railroad Benefits, and Veterans Benefits. First, what I want you to do is I want you to remove preconceptions. Every now and then I hear a strange preconception, and it always sort of baffles me where it comes from. It's like they read it on a tabloid somewhere. You can only apply for a stimulus check if a UFO has shrunk your brain. You can only apply for a stimulus check um, if you danced in a lobster shorts and you waved at the check at the beach and the check um, uh, sang the Macarena back to you. <laughs> and you always hear these strange things. You wonder, where do these people say these things? And one of them I saw the other day is um, someone said something like, well, you have to have a tax return on file for these checks. No... But again, a tax return is off 10 seconds. You go to irs.gov and you fill it out and electronically send it in. It's free to do. But no, that's that's not true. So ultimately, there's always that person who has a preconception about something. Then there's some people that sometimes think too much about it. Just apply. I haven't said this in a long time. It's a very, very important point of advice. Don't think too much about things. Just apply. Why? For every day you wait to apply, thousands of people are, stim are jumping in front of you. This channel delivers a lot of viewership. And so everyone that's watching this video is applying for a check. And you're sitting back thinking, you know what? Maybe I will apply when I have a San Francisco hairstyle. <laughs> and so you wait this out a few days. Guess what? A lot of people stimulus stampeded in front of you. Don't do it. So I think these points of advice are very important. And there's Lynn Glenn listen to you every day and I learn more by listening to you and thank you for being here for us and helping us out especially like me that's on disability this extra money every month really helps me out I could say instead of spending my money on rent uh, I'm able to save it up says thank you happy Thanksgiving May, many blessings to you so the money I normally pay with rent I could just put that uh, and save it every month because I got the help again paying my rent thank you so much for being here with us uh, and I just got approved in time before Thanksgiving, so now I can put away the rent every every next uh, up next month and just start saving like I've always been saving. It's uh, and not blowing my money. I love what she just said. So let me give you the context. Lynn Glenn has gotten fourteen twenty uh, twenty six checks at least from the no twenty seven checks. So she has gotten the stimulus N, but she has also gotten twelve months of rent and 14 months of utilities. Well, that's actually more than 26 checks because it's more than one utility. I mean, she's getting 14 months of utilities. Uh, and if you have four, five utilities a month, bills a month, I mean, that's not 14 checks. That's 14 times five. But I love what she explains to you is that one, go do it. Stop complaining about yourself. Go do it. She says, I'm on disability. I got it. I listened to him. I got it. It's not such a big deal. Just go do it and go get it. Number two, once she says, I got it, guess what? I don't have to spend my money on the rent anymore. And so I'm saving my money on the rent. And we don't talk about 
the issue of savings on this channel enough. I love Lynn Glenn for bringing that up. I'm just using a number. I don't know what Lynn's rent price is. Let's just say her rent is $500 a month. So it says spending $500 this month, she has an extra $500 in her wallet. Next month, she'll have an extra $1,000 in her wallet because she'll save two months. That month after that, she'll have an extra $1,500 of rent money in her wallet because she won't have to be spending her money on rent. And imagine what $500, I'm just using a random number, I don't know if that's her rent. Imagine if her rent is $500 a month for 14 months. That's $7,000 she will have in her wallet. It's just incredible. It's just absolutely incredible. All you have to do is become a member. Let's look at the incredible first three checks right now. They are checks A, B, and C. Checks A, B, and C are just huge. And yes, these were passed by Joseph Biden. First check is check A, $6,500 to $12,000. It's a fourth symbol check in every U.S. state. This is the check that Spelly got and uh, our wonderful Kimberly Morano, Romano got, who also is a brand new member as well. Congratulations, Kimberly Romano, for becoming a brand new member. Uh, $6,500 to $12,000. Check A. How do you get it? Go into this video, become a member. Purple Hawk, Purple Power Calcium VIP. Then go down to where it says check A, click the link, and go right and apply. You're not done there yet. You're going to go get check B. Now, check B is wonderful. It is a beautiful, um, wonderful $15,000 to $80,000 forced to most check in every U.S. state. Why would you not become a member? Let's look at this success story. Here you go. Frank Mancuso, join this channel. Less than 30 days from joining this channel and just paying a few dollars to become a member, what did he get? Tens of thousands of dollars. Why would you not become a member? It doesn't make any sense not to become a member. He only spent a few dollars to become a member and he walked away with tens of thousands of dollars. Let's look at his numbers. 18 months of check B, mortgage, 18 months of utility as well. If that's four utility bills a month, that's five checks there total so far. And 18 months of high-speed internet. Well, that's, you know, six checks a month times 18. Wow. I mean, that is lots and lots of checks. That is, uh, what, that is, it's, it's, it's at least $30,000, maybe $40,000. It's just a lot of money. Now, Kimberly Romano, notice that 18? Here's Kimberly Romano's success story. Hey, LA, I want to share this with all the Purple Hawks. I've applied for check B, and I got approved for 18 months. Again, another viewer getting approved for 18 months. It's happening all the time. You need to do it right today. You need to become a member. She's getting 18 months of utilities plus her HOA fees every month for 18 months. Folks, let's assume that that's $2,000. That's $36,000 plus. She's getting her property taxes, $4,000. That's $40,000. Then she got applied for the weatherizing grant, which is check A. That's $14,000. That brings it to $40,000. Uh, 50,000. I'm so elated, and I can't tell you anything more than I uh, can't be any more excited than that. So she is clearly at about 50,000, not alone because another view out of Florida, different than Frank Mancuso, she got 18 months of checks, five checks a month, thousands of dollars a month. She's nearly at 80 to 100,000 dollars. Just do it right now. What are you waiting for? Go into this video, become a member, and apply for those incredible check Bs, because they're huge, and the recession's just around the quarter. You need big checks to battle a recession, not puny little minuscule checks. Next up is check C, for rent, utilities, mortgage, assistance, and more. This is what Lynn Glenn got. And you know what Spelly did? He had gotten check C, and then he went back and got more money for check C this week as well. That's how you rock and roll. In the membership news, I tell you the 12 places to reach out to. So make sure you reach out to all and you say the key words of what to say in the membership newsletter for rent, utilities, mortgage, assistance, more. Here we go. Do you want $30,000 of rent? We'll go get some check C. And what about these numbers for utilities? Go get them as well. In that list, you see Mark, well, his brother-in-law got $15,000 for utilities, a quarter million dollars over 10 years for SNAP. Then combinations of checks and markers are 32,000. He went to 50,000. 50, then 100, then 100 to 166. And then Lorraine, she was at 105 and she went to 155. Incredible. You do it right today. You go under this video, become a member, Purple Hawk, Purple Power, and Calcino VIP. Now, there have been even more success stories. Drag and triple member to all three channels. She's seen it on $170,000 across the board. We have Johnny, who got his 20 friends and neighbors a quarter million dollars. He got himself 
incredible sums of money additionally and what did he do for his mom and dad 50,000 each these incredible federal stimulus checks let's go over some of the details you need to know they're from the federal government so they have nothing to do with your states they're for you so if you're on SSI SSDI Social Security railroad benefits if you make 75,000 or less or if you're a married couple and make 150,000 or less a year go get them what are you waiting for and in the big second half we're going to continue with these federal stimulus checks then we go over to inflation relief stimulus checks lifetime stimulus checks and yes are you ready for some holidays allied in full form well this is not the christmas tree park but i'm ready for deliver some incredible beauty to you in this big second half it's a huge show and the breaking news continues in that big second half as we go back into more money on four stimulus and the latest details on the housing and the auto industry's collapse those details are more and the latest details on your money heat up the second half see you back in 60 seconds if you want money right now not five days from now and not five weeks from now then reach out to the community page the volunteers can help you find that money for rent and utilities that's at news.la.com forward slash community the community page features a series of volunteers who are viewers like you they can help you find rent utilities snap food benefits mortgage assistance and help you with eviction moratorium questions as well their facebook twitter and instagram individuals reach out to them and indicate the city and state you're from and they'll get back to you shortly that's a community page volunteers working for you viewers helping one another stay with la for more Join LA Late Daily for the excitement of the new LA Late Live Daily. The excitement starts on mornings LA Late at 9 a.m. Home LA Late returns at 11 a.m. daily. And then afternoons LA late at 1 p.m. Join us daily as the excitement continues live from Santa Monica on LA late. And the excitement continue, continues in the big second half as we continue with these massive checks that viewers are getting. And I'm going to show you how to get them as well. It's a big second half. And also, we'll be going out to the Christmas tree park as Holidays LA kits up in full gear this afternoon. I hope you're having a beautiful weekend and happy holidays to you and your family. Let's go right into those big checks. Now, the first three checks we went over were check A, B, and C. Those are the first three checks of those federal stimulus checks. Well, there's more because Congress passed more. And where do you get these checks as well? In the membership newsletter. Did you become a member? Do it right now. Go under the video, click the link to join this channel and get those incredible applications in for check A, $6,500 or $12,000. B, upwards, upwards of $80,000. In some cases, viewers getting over $100,000. And check C, lots of money there. Now let's go into the more checks. Check E, $7,500 stimulus check is check E. Wow. Check F, $4,000 stimulus check. Then we go to stimulus G, a beautiful 30% off stimulus check. Check H, a $2,000 stimulus check. Then we have check I, a beautiful $8,000 stimulus check. Check J, $8,000. Check K, $14,000. That is huge. Then we go to stimulus L, is zero down, in, zero down payment, zero interest, and a beautiful $100,000 brand new mortgage. Stimulus and M is $8,000. That was L. Stimulus M is $8,000 of free grant money for you. Then we go to stimulus N, which is a brand new tablet, computer, or laptop. Incredible. This is what Spelly got, Len Glenn, and also John Malouf. Then we go to stimulus O, zero down payment, zero closing costs on a brand new mortgage, and also 3% refi uh, is stimulus P, and then stimulus Q. A whopping $8,000. There you go. Those are your federal stimulus checks. They are all in the membership newsletter. $300,000, 300 different checks featured all for members in the membership newsletter. Let's go over some more details about them. Largest check, $100,000. Smallest check, $8,000. 
fastest routing time. Two days. Two days, Johnny got checks. How much? In two days, Johnny got $45,000 from this channel. That was between a Monday and a Wednesday. By Friday, he had 80000 because he got 15 applications in and half approved and half rejected. The following week helped mom and dad, 50000 a pop, and then his 20 friends and neighbors, a quarter million dollars. What are these checks for? Rent, utilities, mortgage assistance, more, and also stuff for the home, like home repairs, home appliances, the computer, the tablet, the free internet, the car, lots of incredible stimulus, and it's all for you today. Next up is inflation release stimulus checks, ISC, and I call them ISC also because they're icing on the cake, like the I. They're not the cake, they're the icing on the cake, $1,000. They're deliciousness. What do you learn? How do you learn about them? They're in the membership newsletter. Go down to check B, issue me D, like donut, in the newsletter. It clicks open a brand new page. It tells you the state, the amount of the check, and how to track it across the board. And also, when you're in that membership newsletter, don't forget to use your worksheets. They're totally free for members. They're down around the third line of the, of the membership newsletter. Here are the worksheets. They're a PDF you can print out from your cell phone or computer. And you take notes of the stimulus checks you're applying for on the second page because you're going to be applying for a lot of checks, like Margaret Owens. Margaret Owens... Uh, reports today she has nearly a $3,000 of checks, but she had already gotten six more months of LG&E just days ago. What she's doing is she's applying for checks, getting approved, and going back and getting more checks, just like Spelly. That's what I teach you on this channel. So use those worksheets for you. Now let's go over to those a lifetime stimulus. Once your benefits go up, they never go down. But something no one's telling you is that if you're on SSI, SSDI, Social Security Railroad Benefits, you're not going to get one raise. Oh, no. You're getting four raises. How is this happening? The reason why it's lifetime is because once your benefits go up, they never go down. And it's getting actually even better than that. Imagine you were on the first floor of a sky rise two years ago. Well, for this year, your benefits raised you up 5.9%. Second floor. Next year, you're going to the third floor with an 8.7% raise. Yes. Then you're going to go to the fourth and then finally the fifth floor because j Powell says it's going to be two more years of interest rates across the board and also inflation. So by year four, you will be on the fifth floor with four with five raises, the largest check of a generation. And once your benefits go up, they never go down. But by that time, what's going to happen to the cost of goods? The cheapest of a generation. It's incredible. Suddenly you'll have the largest check and the things you'll be buying will be the cheapest across the board. And with that, it's time for some wonderful excitement. And that excitement is, of course, holidays, LL8. That excitement is really the big bread and butter that we love this holiday season. And last night, did you see what happened on this channel? So last night on this channel, I just randomly pressed record when I was at a location, which I've been at before, but not for video footage on this channel, just for images. And the video just took off. You jumped in the show. It was 8 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. It was featuring beautiful, beautiful Christmas trees. They're of massive magnitude. And yes, it was our show called LA Late Night, where I answer your questions and answers, but the questions were all about the tree. And the answers were all about the tree. And we had a lot of fun. The show was the most watched show in one day on this channel of the month and potentially this entire fall season. It was a blockbuster of a show. In fact, I thought the numbers were a mistake when I first saw them. So with that, why not go into full mode holidays L8 right now? Number one, before I remind, before I get off the message, because I don't want to forget, I'm going to attempt, I don't know if I'll be able to pull it off, but I'm going to attempt to repeat last night's eight o'clock show at the at the tree, at the Christmas tree as often as I can on location at either that place or other similar places in the next few days. So watch this channel. It would come on air around when evenings extra is, right after sun, right after street and stimulus. So with that, let's go out to the Christmas tree park. Today, I went back to the Christmas tree park for the, sec for the third year on this channel to get ready to buy the new LLA tree for the 2022 season. But first, some inspiration before we go to that footage. Here's some inspiration. Let's look at this beautiful tree. This is just cell phone footage 
shot by me inside the Beverly, uh, the, uh, the Beverly Hills Hotel no less than two years ago. Isn't that gorgeous? They put a lot of little, um, let's freeze the frame. They put a lot of beautiful little uh, animals underneath the tree. The coloring scheme is a white light with a red and a pink bow and balls. So you're doing green with white lights, red and pink accents. And then they kept it really on point by using goats. And I know someone's going to send me a message that says, that's not goat. It's a, you know, it's an aardvark. <laughs> you know, goats, they're the same color scheme as your decorations. I love it. Now, everyone loves lights at night. So here is a tree from about two years ago, cell phone footage, on location as well. And I would not normally recognize it unless I saw that building in the corner. Yes, where is this? This is Hermosa Beach. So this is the Hermosa Beach Christmas tree, which I believe it's currently up right now as well. This is old footage from about two, three years ago. They use the same tree almost every year. Look how big that tree is. That is a monster tree. Look in the perspective of that tree compared to that building. Folks, it is almost a three or four story tree. It may be one of the largest trees I know of here in Southern California. Uh, a f a, a near the beach. <laughs> I mean, it is on the beach. It's of that magnitude. So with that, today I went back to the Christmas tree park, embodying everything that I teach you about stimulus and also trees. <laughs> what do I teach you about Christmas trees? Number one, get in there fast. Get into that Christmas tree park as fast as possible right now this holiday season because of a series of reasons. One, we don't know the supply chain disruption still with trees. There were been prior years of problems that they did not have enough trees. Number two, uh, you get the best choice of the picking. Number three, once people are back in town from that Thanksgiving weekend, they're all going to go to that Christmas tree park. Trust me, you don't want to be competing with those people for a tree, just like we call it stimulus stampede. It's tree stampede. <laughs> <laughs> and then finally, um, you can take your time and really get it right. So I shot footage today, two parts of the footage. You're going to see the first part of the footage right now. I've not even watched it since I taped it. So in a way, it's almost like B-roll, but it, it, is, it, is, um, it is the footage just filmed no less than about three hours ago, me on location. And uh, the second half of this footage you will see tomorrow on this channel. In this first footage, you're seeing me go into the park, I'm going to feature the trees, not myself, in this footage. And what I'm going to be looking for is finding the right tree that I need and then giving you the options of what to look for. In tomorrow's second half of this footage on the show at 11 o'clock, you will, or 3 o'clock, you will then see me going up close to face-to-face uh, uh, -face with the trees and showing you how to pick the trees. So here we go, entering the Christmas tree park. Here we are at the Christmas tree park entering and you have noble furs on the right and you have douglas furs straight ahead and this season they have an extra type of fur on the right side i've never seen before but look at this pretty enormous now so you're going to choose between a smaller tree um you know four to five feet or you're going to choose something that is larger that is six to seven or potentially seven to eight i like a tree that has a lot of size to it so see this year we have norman fur which is something we've never seen before very 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 exciting um and then when they're propped up you get a better sense of how tall they are here are the douglas firs five to six they're smaller in height and then the norman firs which have a softer uh, coat to them what i like about the taller trees is that they have a really nice um with and you can smell that aerobics uh element in the tree already now when choosing a tree what you want to do is make sure that the tree has that really really healthy component in it already so let's start here we are with a douglas fir eight to nine here we go so the douglas fir eight to nine so what i don't want you to focus on is so much the base but i want you to focus on the strength of the leaf so here we go the leaf is to touch quite firm really really quite firm the leaves are all upward trending there's a strong aromatic smell and then the colorization is quite good so when you do that three-point step you want to make sure that the that the odor is there that the color is there and that the strength of the leaf is there as well 
um, let me come a little bit tighter. When I'm looking at the tree, now see we have some trees down on the ground. It gives us a better sense of the width of the tree. Here is my hand, so you have a perspective of how wide these trees are. Um, we're going now into smaller trees at this point. But uh, dug this eight to nine, which is my preferred height, uh, because they really aren't, they aren't really nine, sometimes they really are eight. Let's look and see how good this tree is. I mean, look at that. The first, when you wiggle your hand in the tree, the leaves are very, very firm. The, the pines are, and the, and the thistles are very, very firm. So this is a great tree to get. Um, you feel the moistness of the tree. It's very, very lush and very fresh. You also smell it. You also see that the colorization are quite good. In the case of Douglas firs, you are with a tree that... Um, is generally relatively quite uh, strong in its in its odor. Um, one of the things to consider when doing the Douglas tree is that you want that tree to bring in that incredible strength of its uh, of its of its presence. Let me give you another long. And there you go. And there you go. As the audio, as the audio goes out. Goes out. Testing. Testing. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Testing. 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 And there you go. That is the Christmas Tree Park first part. And tomorrow we will return back to the Christmas Tree Park here along the shores of Santa Monica, California. And we look at where the right tree is and how to choose the right tree. It's all economical and it is all lush and beautiful at the same time. We'll go over all those details and more, but let's go back into the market news and what we're dealing with in a robust week. The first major week back from the holiday shopping season. First week back since the Federal Reserve had those minutes released, and the first week back since labor has fallen apart. That and more heats up the big second half starting right now. How are you? So one of the things we're looking for in this brand new week is something that is data driven. And there's gonna be a lot of non-data driven comments. Let me analyze this for you across the board. We have a very short time frame between now and December 31st in which the market players really try to get some wins. And that's why we have a Santa Claus rally. In a Santa Claus rally, stocks rally up this month of December. They always do, even in a recession, even in a bear market. So expect stocks to rally up, number one. Number two, expect analysts to really focus on the data that came in on those retail sales numbers, but still be confused and still be not insightful about it because they don't have the full robust of those numbers. Next, when the retail sales numbers are released once a month and they'll be coming around the second or third week of December, that's not indicative of what happened this holiday season. Why? Retail sales is not how much of an how many items were sold. For example, here is your chapstick. Imagine the chapstick was $2 in the month of February. Well, if you went back to buy the chapstick in December, maybe or November, maybe it was $4. That would show retail sales went up. Doesn't mean you bought more chapstick or the chapstick company sold more pieces of chapstick. It just means their price point was more expensive. So retail sales number released right with that CPI and the PPI the second week of December won't help us at either as well. We really need to get those corporations out there and giving us guidance, and we will. Those corporations will start to give us guidance on what they saw in those numbers from the holiday spending across the board. And then we're going to start to digest them and see, do we see industry trends? And those industry trends will then guide us on how to deal with this economy left and right. 
Finally, my predictions. My predictions is you're going to see in the latest numbers coming out in the next few days, one, that stocks will rally up, two, that bonds will pull back a little bit, three, the Federal Reserve will do 50 basis point at that FOMC meeting in mid-December. Next, I also believe you're going to see auto numbers to be really poor. You're going to see new car sales down, used car sales down, housing absolutely horrible as well. And you're also going to see apparel as a mixed bag, some doing really well and some missing. Plus, you're going to have a lot of analysts running incorrect data or incorrect analysis not based upon data. For example, Federal Reserve pivot, not happening. For example, saying that inflation has come down. It has not that much. And finally, ultimately, it's going to be a very, very couple confusing weeks, but we'll navigate it together through this incredible broadcasting family. From the shores of Santa Monica, California, thank you for joining me on this special edition of Holidays, Ally, and maybe I will be live with you again from another Christmas tree spot tonight across the board. From the shores of Santa Monica, California, God bless. Stay informed, stay focused. Happy holidays. Don't forget to become a member. Get all those incredible checks because all the applications are open on the weekend. Stay informed, stay focused, and stay with Ally for more. <laughs>